Greetings, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Nostalgic Notions, a little series where we play about 15 to 20 minutes of an old retro game. It's kind of a nice way to check out a whole bunch of old games in a very quick fashion. I am the Duck of Indeed, and today's game is Clue Clue Land from 1985. It was on the original NES, and uh, just if I sound weird, I kind of have a cold right now, just to let you guys know. <laughs> Greedy sea urchins have stolen all of Clu Clu Land's gold bars and buried them in a series of mazes. As Bubbles a brave bubblefish, you'll set out to uncover all the gold bars. Okay. 21 stages. Let's let's check this out. <laughs> What am I doing? I think that I think this was one of the games you used to be able to get on the original Animal Crossing. So this is a uh, confusing. You just have to uncover the gold bars, I guess. You have to go to every single space, I guess. It's confusing. Oh! Get off the screen! Oh, the stupid thing keeps going on the screen. I don't need controls! I don't need controls. Get off the screen. Can you please get off the screen? I can't see. Sorry about that, you guys. Okay, so you have to you have to go all over the screen and try to uncover all the gold, I guess. Kind of makes me think of Pac-Man, but not quite. <laughs> ah! What does the green thing do? I gotta see what the green thing does. No, get get the get the green thing. I got points. I don't know what it really does though. So it looks like the gold kind of makes a shape, so maybe that makes it easier to find all of it. Oh. Yeah, it makes a heart shape. Let's see. Go, 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 go! No! Nah! Oh! oh. Is that bad? If I go in the middle? And I have a time limit, too. Oh! Let's see if I can- I would like to get through at least one. Okay, now this is going badly. I was doing good before. It makes a shape. No! I want to at least get through one level. Before the end of this video. We got close that time. Let's try it again. Well, it looks like it makes a shape, so that makes it easier. Does it make the same shape every time, or...? I don't... I think it doesn't. Come on! My goal for this episode is to beat at least one area. This is definitely a different shape this time. No! I was doing actually really good last time and all of a sudden started doing very badly. What is that? What's a flag do? Like, if I ever did play this game, it might have been when they let you play these kind of games on the original Animal Crossing. You could collect these kind of games, which was kind of cool, but Obviously, with the the virtual console and stuff, Nintendo stopped letting you do that. It was cool back then, though. Oh! Looks like a house or something this time. No! No! 
This is hard to control. This is hard to control! Go! Game over. Come on. We gotta at least get one. We gotta at least get through one stage. And the picture... No! Why? The picture changes every time. What are the cherries for? <laughs> Probably just points. I think a lot of things are just points. I don't even know if the urchins actually come after you at all. I can't control this! <laughs> I wonder what this one's gonna be. Go! Go! It's stressful! Go! The hardest thing for me is controlling it. It seems... I don't know, it just seems really hard to control. Weird to think this is what games used to be like. What am I doing? Try I don't- It looks like a person this time. Come on, we're getting there. No! So close. Actually, I could. Do, I can still do this. I did it. We did it. We got through one stage. Yay! Good job. I think they said there's like 21 levels. It would be really hard to get through that many levels. Okay, so you can't go in those blue things. And now there's two of them. Seems like a lot faster now. Oh! This is confusing! Oh! <laughs> this is very confusing. Wonder what it's gonna be this time. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Ah. Oh! We're gonna get another game over pretty soon. What is this gonna be? No! Don't touch that! Don't touch that! No! Go! Game over. We'll try a little bit longer. That's a, uh, yeah. That's Clue Clue Land for you guys so far. This is what video games were like back in the 80s. Some of them, anyway. <laughs> Let's try just a little bit. I just try just a little bit. What's, I guess the fruit is just points. Let's get that pineapple. <laughs> it's confusing. Oh, it's, it's so confusing to be able to move. Gotta go around those dots. For me, that's really a lot harder than it needs to be. <laughs> oh! It's like, it's kind of Pac-Man-ish, but not quite. And harder to control, I think. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> what is this gonna be? That's kind of like a it's gonna be a weird face, maybe. I can't... I can't control it! <laughs> I can't control it. So good. It's so confusing. It looks like a face, though. I... I can't... I can't control it. Yeah, those are eyes. And there's a mouth. So... No! No!
wait a minute. Let me try. Why? What were they doing in that? Are there other buttons in this? Let me just see something real quick. What does this do? Wonder what the what is this? What does this do? Ah, I see. I didn't know you could do that. So you can um, you can stop the sea urchins with that, and then they can't do anything. Oh, very interesting. Well, let's see if we can get through this area now that we have that a better understanding of all of this. Yeah, we can just push them around now. You can actually destroy them. You can actually destroy the sea urchins now. Well, that's interesting. I think it's gonna be a dude again. I think it's gonna be a person. No! Oh, but the, yeah, the sea urchins come back, but you can kill them. So that's, a uh, interesting. Oh, I didn't get that one. We're just gonna try one more time. Oh! And they can apparently get caught in the, uh, gold stuff, which is odd. <laughs> Why did I go in that? Oh my gosh. Well, there you have it, you guys. Clue Clue Land for the original Nintendo. It's Oh, I might be able to get it this time. Nor not. <laughs> we got close. Anyway, that's Clue Clue Land for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. As usual, don't forget to visit us at virtualbastion.com for more gaming goodness. Goodbye, and you're welcome.